This is an ultrasound clip demonstrating a wrist effusion in a patient presenting to the emergency department with atraumatic wrist pain, swelling, redness, and difficulty arranging the joint. A linear probe is placed in the longitudinal axis between the distal radius seen here in red and scaphoid seen here in green with the probe marker oriented distally. In this clip, we can appreciate the distal radius as a hyperechoic line with posterior shadowing. The scaphoid can be seen here adjacent to the distal radius. An extensor tendon of the wrist can be seen as a fibular structure with multiple parallel lines crossing the joint space. Note this anechoic fluid anterior to the scaphoid. This represents a wrist joint effusion. Contrast this to a normal wrist where minimal to no fluid should be seen. In patients presenting with atraumatic wrist pain, the physical exam can often be limited by significant pain and swelling. Ultrasound can help narrow the differential between cellulitis, abscess, or joint effusion. It can further be used either statically or dynamically to guide arthrocentesis and help determine the etiology of the effusion.